Okay, we're here, we're back, I'm live with more Trails of Cold Steel 4. So, as we left off, we made it to Raquel. And, okay, we went to a lake, we fought some monster in some dungeon. Got some kind of a flashback, not entirely sure what that's about. So, I mean, I have guesses, but we'll see. So, we're... Yeah, we met up with fortune teller lady person. She told us nothing we didn't already know, I suppose. But still. Anyway, yeah. So, in between streams, I did a little bit of grinding for some cash so I could buy some stuff. Because there was stuff here I wanted to buy, but I didn't have any money last time. So we're gonna buy some gear, and then we're gonna head off into the great wide unknown. Give me a minute to deal with that. I don't remember what I just bought, I promise. <laughs> So yeah, we're in Raquel, which is Ash's hometown, so he's in disguise. Because him getting recognized would be dead, would be terrible and awful for everyone involved. So it's best if nobody knows who he is. Because, you know, he's he's kind of the most wanted man in the country right now. So yeah. But we need information, so we're just gonna talk to everybody and see what we can find. If we can find anybody. Fingers crossed. This place. Ash used to come here all the time. Well, welcome! Five of you. Please, sit wherever you like. You! For goodness sake, why do you always pop up so suddenly? Well, I'm glad you're back safe. Welcome home, Ash. Well, that lasted all of five minutes. Hmm. Eh, you never change. Who's this? I think I've seen them somewhere. Oh, it can't be. <laughs> Seriously? What is worried there, Ash? You were falsely accused of being Calvardian spy. Now you're back with your friends. I'm sure your mom led you to them. Huh, I guess. Just show them how you really feel, Ash. This kind woman and your friends really believed in you. Yeah, I've known you since you were a kid. There's no way you would do that. I mean, they're not wrong. He isn't a spy, but he did shoot the emperor. So let's let's just not tell them what really happened. You know, probably so, some secrets are just best left hidden. Uh, I don't know. I could see Ash pulling off a double life as an assassin. I'm going to take that as a compliment. Over, I hear your instructor has gone missing. Things must be tough for all of you. Eh, we're getting by a little bit. Though, yes, we do need to find Reed and Muse. Although, I'm sure we're going to find Muse first. That is where... That is what we are currently trying to gather information about. Has anything changed around here? Changed? Well, we've had a lot more tourists. Some of them look a bit more well-off than our regular clientele. More well off. Yeah, some of them come in, in these nice suits and expensive dresses. I think I heard something about them coming from Ordis by limousine to hold meetings or something? I'm not too sure. I wonder if they were merchants or perhaps nobles? I'd like to know what they came here for. If you're going to sneak around, just be careful. You don't know who's looking where, after all. Eh, I don't need you giving me advice. Once we've got the intel we're after, we're out of here. Came this way to see you. Stop standing around looking sad. Got it? 
Thanks, Ash. Keep up the good work with your classmates. Ah, They love him, and I don't blame them. He's just a big softy on the inside. Ooh, kiss. Pay 700 pyramid to try spaghetti bolognese. It's recipe can be memorized. Yes, please. You tried the recommended dish. Memorize the recipe for spaghetti bolognese. Awesome. Have anything worth buying? Eh. Nothing. Let's go. Aren't you glad your friends didn't give up on you? <laughs> sure am. See, we're not the only ones who have faith in him. I mean, he doesn't seem to have any faith in himself, but we do. So, gotta, gotta start somewhere. Uh, hi, friend? Question mark. Isn't she a friend of yours, Ash? Yeah, my mom knew her. Oh, well. Ah. Hey, long time no see. My my. Isn't Ash always showing up unannounced? Good to see you really were okay after all. I'm glad. Ah. Uh, wait, shouldn't you be more surprised? as if you knew all along that Ash was safe. Oh, well, that's because a certain someone passed on the information to me. Was she about this tall and had green hair? She said she'd been contacted by a classmate in Masante. Oh. Oh! Is she here? She's waiting for you on the second floor. I'll show you. Friend! Please come in! Not the friend who we were looking for, but hey, it'll do. You? Eh, knew it was you. Class 8, Combat Tactics, Ash, Maya. Evelyn. Welcome. I'm so glad you're safe. I couldn't believe it when Sydney told me. I'm so happy to see you all. But where have you been? Please, tell me everything. I don't know if he'll believe us, but sure. I mean, things are weird, but... I see. So you showed up here because it... So if it's connected to your father. <sighs> hmm. Who's a regular here? Hmm. That's why Julia happy, happily let me have a room to stay in. I actually came thinking my father might be here, but it seems he hasn't been coming by lately. But he's not drinking, but I did hear he was contacted by the military division he used to belong to. That's... worrying. Why is it the former sniper, Captain Joseph? I believe I saw that name in the database. If the military requested him to return, it's likely they also had him promoted. On that note, do you know what happened to Leonora and the others? I heard you came together. Good stuff, too. His mining town shouldn't be that far from here. I heard Sadie's from Lumaire, too. Ulster specifically, I think? Yes. Those two headed to their hometowns past the Northern Canyon. Leah went to Ortiz, where she had a contact to gather intel. There have, been, there have also been sightings of mysterious reddish-black flowers in the Canyon Road area. Could that be the blue? Pleroma grass? It seems very likely. Well, I guess we have to go check that out. So Leonora is an artist, capital of the Lemaire province. It's also in USA's hometown. We visited before during our field exercises. Do you have any information on the state of affairs there? According to Leo, collecting information in Ortiz is pretty tough at the moment. There's the security detail set up by Governor Regnans, who was appointed as the interim supervisor. To make matters worse, there's also the 3rd Armored Division that is currently stationed at Uno Naval Force Fortress. Is his father in the third armored division? That means right sex. My uncle is in charge of that division. We met the governor during our field exercises, but Kurt's uncle? 
He is one of the top three great commanders of the Imperial Army, and the one who fought against General Le Guin during the Civil War. If both of these men are in Le Maire, it would be very difficult for our current group to go to Ordis. Damn it, that would have been a great chance to get some info, but... Yes, you're right. I'm curious, but it would be probably be best to keep away for now. Thank you, Maya. This this helped us decide on how we want to proceed. It's nothing. I just wish it could have been of more help. I'll check contacting Ordis to see if I can obtain any information on the Singularity or Instructorine. If I find anything, I'll be sure to let you know. I wish you the best in your efforts as well. Thanks, Maya. Things are looking tough for all of us, but let's do our best. As fellow branch campus students. Aww. Friendship! Well. Here we go, we need to go to down here. Hello, friend. Uh, adios. Offer me your guidance. Please, watch over him. I'm sure there has to be some mistake. That's the lady who took care of Ash. Ash. I know, I know. Hey! All that moping around ain't like you. Huh? It, Ash! It's, it's such a relief to see you. I can't tell you how worried I was. I heard this nasty rumor that you'd been arrested for something terrible and I didn't know what to think. Alright, alright, simmer down. The rumor you heard wasn't a rumor. I did shoot the Emperor. Uh, why are you telling her that? Maybe don't tell her that. Shut. Ash. That's alright. We know you. There must have been other circumstances. Besides, no one is beyond redemption. Think of how far you've already come. You could atone for your sin. Well, I mean, we are going to save the world together, so I think that evens the playing field, right? I believe in you. You may not be perfect, but you have a good heart, Ash. You're a good person. <laughs> People closest to you really do get you, huh, Ash? It's a good thing, really. Ugh, don't you get all sappy on me now? Seems like there were a lot of there was a lot there was a lot of chaos here during the great great twilight. It's true. People started fighting all over the city. A strange wind blew, and then those red and black flowers started blooming everywhere. Violence ended fairly quickly. But the eerie atmosphere has loomed over the city ever since. Even with the hustle and bustle from the increasing number of tourists, it feels like there's a darkness hanging over all of us. I've felt it in the other towns as well. Perhaps the short breather before the drought was merely the calm before the storm. Hell, this place is kind of a storm to begin with. All those Jaegers coming and going. You take care of yourself, Volta. I'll make sure that I do. Yeah, so sweet. Okay, nothing else here. It wasn't too difficult to gather information this time. Given how, <sighs> given how busy of a town this is, yeah. And I'm glad things went over well for you, too, Ash. You've still got a lot of people here that trust in you. That's gonna feel good, right? Meh. It's like anyone would believe I was a Kilvardian assassin anyway. But there is something. Something? Go on. Forgot it. Just talking to myself. So, what's next? Personally, I found the information Maya gave us concerning. I'm honestly tempted to get in touch with my uncle at the Naval Fortress. I wish I could say otherwise, but that's not going to be an option. The security around Ortiz is really tight right now. Can't risk getting caught before we get a chance to see the general. 
Right. It's too risky. Besides, we really should be prioritizing, prioritizing the singularity. Zandy and Gustav reported something that looked like Paroma grass in the north. It would be wise to follow up on that. We're going to waste a lot of time if it turns out that's not the place. Oh, wait. I think I've got it. the hell's that? Is Elliot's pendulum? Yep, she said we could use it to find any singularities, right? Still not sure how it works, but it should react some way, I think. Ugh, can't believe we put up with this ridiculous shit. It's reacting. You've got to be kidding me. So we have to go to the northeast. Looks like it. Let's keep move. Let's get moving. <laughs> I'll thank you to stay put. Oh no. Who saw us? No way. Hey, that's one of Instructor Rainsell's schoolmates, isn't it? The managing director of the government allied Cleast and Co. Hugo Cleast. Cleast. Whatever his name is. <laughs> We meet again, new class seven, and an old friend to boot. He sounds nerdy. I I feel like I should remember who this is, but I don't remember who this is the slightest. Uh, I'm sure he has fans, though. I've been hoping for a little heart to heart, one generation of Thors to another. Oh no. Is that why you brought goons? Give me a break. You're the government's damn lapdog. For now, we should. I'm afraid this is as far as you're going. They blocked us in. When did they get here? We have resources, and we decided now is the perfect opportunity to make our move. And speaking of our source, I'd say he earned himself a little bonus. I knew it. That old dumb outs, dumbass sold us out again. But someone else tipped him off. But the only people who recognized you were your friends. And the one who tipped him off. Could it have been? Now, now, given your current situation, there's really no point in trying to suss out the details. Let's just say one of my clients has been searching for that dark-haired lad, so I'd appreciate it if you let him come with me. I'd appreciate it if you'd kiss That's my- That's quite enough, Kleist. Kleist, okay. <laughs> oh, hey, it's you. Him, him I know, I think. I, I know you. That's the boy we met in Parm. What seems to be the problem, <laughs> Vincent? I should think that obvious, Hugo. You are bothering my delightful guests. That's a rather aggressive move to make, after inking such a delicate agreement. Oh, no. And as a journalist, I can't just turn a blind eye. I mean, I'm right here. <laughs> Whoops. I was so convinced that boy was someone I knew. I was clearly mistaken, however. Do excuse me for the trouble. Take good care of those guests of yours, yes? A pleasure as always, Vincent. Hey, wait! Hugo, you have to know, right? Where are Mint and Becky? I'm afraid I can't help you there. I wish I knew myself. So many missing people! Phew. Looks like we're in the clear. Thanks so much. You really saved us. It's as I thought. You were friends with the original Class 7, aren't you? Yeah, <laughs> sure I am. Thought I'd check in on, how you, on you guys to see how things have been going. You're both comrades who bore the horned lion elbow. I was a year apart from class seven in our school days. Huh. By the way, are you a for Freaking these names. These names will eat the death of me. Floral? By the ch by any chance? I'm just gonna call him Vincent. Ah oh, Pardon my manners. 
I am indeed Vincent Florald. That's worse. The eldest son of Count Florald, a proud Thor's alumnus and consummate hunter of love. Eh, he'll do. We're only testing this guy because we are dreadfully short in allies right about now. <coughs> oh, you're f so you're Ferris's brother. Indeed, I simply must thank you for helping my dear sister. It was much appreciated. Huh. It's nice to see you haven't changed. And Rex... We only just missed each other in Sutherland. Yeah, I would have loved a, ch a chance to chat with both you you guys and Margarita. I see. So that's another reason why you were covering Titus Gate then. So a part so that part about Vivi, as well as the request for scenic pictures, were because you already knew about us. Yeah, I heard all I heard about you all from her before, and it just kinda clicked. It must be fate you're here. Hey, can I get a quick pic of each of you, Yuna and Alcina? Uh, no. <laughs> Maybe some other time, okay? Man, just how many weirdos is our fr is our instructive friends with? All of them. <laughs> it's like, Rita's like a weirdo magnet, let's be honest. He, he's friends with like every weirdo in the country. And that's why we love him. <laughs> Margarita certainly was a unique individual as well. She was always unusual in school. After graduating, she took it to a whole new level. Heh, <laughs> as a matter of fact, Vincent. Cough, splitter, cough, that aside. There must be a connection made by Reen tying us together. Of course, there are some who broke that connection to walk a different path, just as Kleist did. Hmm. Seems you had formed some sort of agreement with him. What sort of business would you have with him? A man with ties to the Imperial government. Right, he was regarding a specific decision. A decision not publicly recognized the existence of the Weisland army. Noble powers are not to recognize the Weisland's army, Weisland army's existence publicly. You are to cooperate with the draft. If you comply, you'll only suppress those who collude with the who directly collude with the Weisland army. That's about what the decision includes. What the the Weisland army doesn't exist? No, it does exist, and it's starting to make moves. Yes, successor to the Kyan Dukedom, Muse, or Lady Mildine, and General Lequin are leading them. I put together a pretty formidable formidable force, including the Panther Girl. Probably still pale in comparison to the Imperial Army, though. It seems they have an army of under a hundred... Of, of a hundred thousand under their command. Not even we, or the nobles of the four great houses, knows what they're currently doing. This is just like with Eusis. So they cannot recognize the army publicly. And they won't be punished as long as they cooperate with the draft. I see. The Imperial wants it to be as if the Weisland army doesn't exist. What? Eh, so that's what it's about. It's harder to rally people to go to war with Kelvard if another civil war was about to go down. The government would be pressured to deal with that before they could roll out the army for anything else. Oh! Currently, the Great Twilight has helped direct the hostility of the Imperial people toward Kelvard. It appears, however, that the Weisland army has the gentle to disrupt that effect, so the government hasn't reported anything. Instead, choosing a complete lockdown of information regarding it. Is that correct? Exactly. There'll be censors at the Imperial Chronicle, too. I've gotta say, the Imperial government is just one is one thing. A certain noble lady is just as impressive. In return for losing various types of support by cutting off relations with the nobles, wasn't army like a tiger released into the wild, has attained its freedom. In this game of chess, she has made a number of highly calculated decisions. She is truly is a bold, fearsome strategist. You say... I wonder what exactly they're planning. 
Even with Principal Le Guin and Brigadier General Bardius, the chances of successfully resisting the Imperial Army are slim. Whatever the plan is, I'll bet it's crazy. I mean, I would I would say taking a hundred thousand people and a bunch of warships and going AWOL is pretty crazy to start with. <laughs> like, at that point you kind of have to commit. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. Just like with getting Instructor Reen back, we have business with Muse. Her to just part ways with us like that. The talk we need to have is with Muse Egret specifically. Not with the noble lady Mildine, what's her name? Uh, hello there. Yuna. Eh. Right. <laughs> Phew. You are all way too much. Even more than I'd heard. Ian's got some interesting students, for sure. Then in regards to that, we'll be looking forward to seeing how you all fare. We have an agreement with the government, but nothing in it stipulates that we may not cooperate with you. In order to find the missing alumni, including my sister and Reen. I'd like to insist your endeavors, Class 7. What do you say? Yeah, we're down. Looking forward to working with you. Yay, friends. Afterward, the group said farewell to Vincent and Rex, who returned to Ordis. They then resumed their activities. They said they'd contact us if anything happened in Nordis, so there's that. I think we should head over to the North Canyon Road. Right, the pendulum is swinging towards the northeast. I believe Sandy and Gustav's hometowns are both in that direction. What's bothering you? Is there something on your mind, Ash? Nah, you're talking about Alistair and the Argon Mines, right? Pretty far apart. This one hell of a trek, no matter which way we start out. Better make sure we're all ready to go before we get out of here. Got it. You know what's down this alley, right? Yeah, and we haven't visited yet either. You think we should drop by before we set out? Uh, yeah. I remember where things are. Let's go. He's a good puppy. He appears to be more agitated than I remember. Cool your jets, Pooch. We're not gonna hurt you. Doggo. I thought I said we didn't need to come back. So this is Ash's home. Alright, let's at least get some fresh air in here. Seems like some of you been cleaning regularly. So it should be fine to just do some light dusting. I'll get a damp cloth. Hey, don't you any don't any of you listen. Uh. Oh, see so her mom passed away from an illness. Well, my adopted mother. This old merchant brought me here at night. He started to leave me with some chick that worked at a club he was always hanging around in. I don't remember what he was like. Old hags, just as strange for taking me in at his request. But I bet she was still a good mom to you, right? Have you started remembering anything about your family in Hummel? No, I mean, I was just three. The only things I remember were shouting and screaming. I can remember this, this older guy and some brat there, too, but... The orphans of Hamel. When I've gathered, there seem to be two others beside you. However, one died three years ago. Guess so. I can't even remember their names. 
doesn't matter. This is my home. Now that I've committed this crime, I can't show my face here. Hush. You said you're going to make things better, right? Yeah, at least to the point where I can face an old hag and everyone else. Alright, that's enough. Let's start heading for the North End Canyon Road. Ah, uh, friendship. Glad we did that. And where did we go? So whatever is waiting for us. Guess you tend to give your regards to your mom, eh? It's been a while, Ash. You're really going to roll back to town and not give a little, little hello to old Miguel. That's... He was the informant who sold us out to the Jaegers during our field exercises. What's this about? Yeah. You're the ones who sold us out to Kleist. Rude. I'm gonna drop by and say hello myself. Gotta thank you a lot, too. So it'll make some good money. Figured as much. What about you, Brad? You sold the old info on us through Miguel, yeah? Is that what you were talking about? I suppose his hunch was right, then. You always had good instincts, I'll give you that. That's always, trick that's always ticked you off, hasn't it, Brad? Yeah, that's the nice way of putting it. I don't know what the whole story is, Ash. Hearing you screwed up so damn bad sure gave me a rush. Hold on. How dare you, Ash? <laughs> give me a break. You're not so innocent yourself. You've let Miguel really take you for a ride. You can spot a lie if it bit you in the ass. Shut the hell up. Just ignore him. Ain't no reason to listen to a criminal. We lost this battle. The war's not over yet. Don't show your face in this town again, or else. Don't you forget it, Ash. <sighs> There's no helping some people. Hang on. What did he mean? It's just like before. Is this a result of the Empire's curse? Dumbass. Selling out to the government like that. Well, it's not like I've got the time to deal with it now. Let's keep moving, yeah? Ash. He's right. We need to head out to the Northern Canyon. Going somewhere. Uh, hi, friend. You, you okay? Ugh, what's going into Stan? Wasn't like this when we first set out. This guy's from the Imperial Army. Seems like he's got something troubling him. Why don't we ask him? Oh, can I help you with something? Is this about Stan again? What has he done now? Uh. No, this isn't about Stan. Phew, that's a relief at least. <laughs> For sure. So would you mind if we ask you a few questions? Sure, go ahead. I will say though, in this uniform I've got might give you some ideas, but I'm just a new recruit. Best friend Stan also joined the army with me. He came to take a breather here. Problem is, he's been acting really weird lately. Since we got here, he's been causing all kinds of trouble. Back when he grew up, he was always confident and not the type of back down, but he never bothered anybody. The curse must be affecting Stan. I want him to snap out of this already. It's just... Uh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't be bothering strangers with my problems, huh? But I've got something to do about it myself, at least. He's one of my best friends, after all. Hmm. I would like to help. Yeah, he seems in a real bind. You sure are gluttons for punishment, aren't you? Schwartz is really rubbed off on you. Not for Dolan to hand. Well, we'd be glad to help if you'd like. Oh, that's very kind of you and all, but I don't think there's anything in it for you guys to help me. That's alright, we just want to, want to offer our assistance where we can. No need for anything in return. Yeah, yeah. 
I'm not doing entirely of the goodness of our hearts, pal. Raquel's my hometown, you know. Last thing I want is some rowdy asshole messing up the place. Ah, uh, I really am sorry about that. I really don't know what happened to him. Maybe you all speak to him. He'll probably he'll realize what he's doing is wrong. In that case, we have to meet Stain and see what he's like for ourselves. Yeah, we better start with that. <laughs> Seems like you really can count on you guys. Sorry for the hassle. Your help might just be the only way to fix this. Stan should be in the casino. It's this big grin on his face since I last saw him yelling, Jackpot, jackpot, here goes nothing. So he likes to gamble. I already sense trouble in the air. Let's cut the chat and get moving. Quest won't stand for this, Jardif. Okay, who am I looking for? Forwards. So we need to find... Person. Time to kick somebody in the butt. Welcome! Who cares about all the bad stuff happening in the world? Come have some fun and gamble those worries away. Just remember, this is a private little paradise for members only. Can't let any of you beautiful folks in without a membership card first. Nice place again, huh? Hey, Ash, where do you think you're going? I don't have time to play around right now. Easy, that girl. I just figured this would be a good place to get some info. Alright, you have a membership card for this place, don't you? Those who did help us find Instructor Green once before, when we came here for field exercises. It shouldn't hurt to look inside. Just do so as long as we keep to our objective. Let me know when you're ready. I'll flash my card and get us in. Do I have to switch to sure. him? Sure. I'll assume I have to switch to him. Okay. Surprise mm. corner. Let's see what if you have anything of interest. Hmm. Neat. Don't care though. Ah, uh, that's that's a funny name. Welcome to Alicia. Is there anything I can help you with? Actually, there is something we want to ask you. They asked the manager if any especially aggressive soldiers had come by. One has indeed. He left just a short while ago. Shoot! Sounds like we just missed each other. Yeah, managed to flush all his military money down the toilet like, by playing like an idiot, I'm guessing. I don't know the full story, but I know he was losing rather badly. Played slots for a while, he was shouting and making a scene the whole time. Once he began being a machine, we had to ask him for, ask him to leave for the day. You see. Do you see where he went next? Someone in the direction of the theater. He was storming out. He said something about seeing a play to lift his spirits. The theater, so that's where he's headed. Thank you very much for your help. Okay, let's get out of here. And we're leaving. This way. Oh no. Kindly leave. Can I help you? As you may see, I'm quite busy at the moment. We're sorry to bother you. You won't take long. Very well. They asked Ridnor if any aggressive soldiers had been out and about. Uh, we did just have a patron who was difficult, in a word. He came to our theater and thought he was above paying the ticket price. He screamed at us that soldiers deserve special treatment and should be granted admission for free. We had to push past to get in, so we ended up having to call security. You see, so he really. So he only does what he wants and then nothing else. Would you tell us which direction he went? Right, he made a bit of a scene and stormed off towards the station plaza. Which is something about being absolutely starved after wandering all over town. Yeah, alright. Thanks for the tip. He ought to be he might be in the pub then. Let's check it out. Thank you for your help. Where are it? Where are we going? Okay. And here we go. Alright, moron. What if I didn't deserve this disgustingly strong fish pie? 
This is your first time making a fish pie. Everyone knows you're supposed to use simple freshwater fish, not whatever this is. That's how they do it back home. I hear you. That's just how it goes here. We can't get our hands on any freshwater fish. So, so it's salt water only, I'm afraid. Sorry it's not to your liking, but there's not much more I can do. Do you think that's... Yeah, that must be the new recruit, Stan. It's just like his friend said. Ugh, what a jerk. You folks looking to order something? Just give me a minute, and I can take your... Hey, Granny, what about my order, huh? Bring me a madame fish pie. How rude. I don't think you should have to remake that. The customer is always right. If I had the ingredients in the recipe, I could make it. Uh, you're way too nice for your own good. If things were different, I don't want to send that guy packing. Hush. Let's try to settle this peacefully, for her sake. So, recipe and the ingredients, huh? Hey, you don't gotta worry about it. Whatever it is, we can make it. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Thank you, all of you. You wanted a fish pie made with fresh butter fish, is that correct? Yeah, but alright, if you think you can do it, let's see. Impress me. Do our very best, just for you. And where can we find a recipe that uses freshwater fish? Hey, we just visited a town with a beautiful lake. Now that you mentioned it, I do kind of feel like things will work out if we head to Mosante. Alright, send these folks on an inn or something. Let's head out. Ash, all of you, thank you so much. What a prick. Are we sure we can't just beat him in the upside the head? Everyone, know something wrong? Actually, we were hoping to consult you about something. You have explained to Albin what was going on. You see, that troublesome soldier wants to eat a fish pie made with freshwater fish. It's neither fresh freshwater fish or different from saltwater fish. Fishy taste is a lot stronger, so it's harder to use. Fish pie I make with fish caught from the lake might suit him. So, do you serve it here or too, huh? Yep, I don't have enough ingredients, so it's temporarily off the menu. I'm gonna bring it back at some point, though. I'm gonna tell my family recipe for you. Now. Memorize the recipe for delicious fish pie. Thank you for sharing your recipe with us. It's not exactly a big family secret or anything. Enjoy it. Thank you very much. As we inquire the ingredients, we should be able to make one in no time. Let's make it and get back to Raquel. Okay. Okay. Thankfully, that, those are things that are not hard to get my hands on. Where's the, where's the grocery store? <laughs> Somewhere. General store. This way. Right. Yeah. Let's go. A little bit of salt and grains. Shop. My sorted grains. Get a few. Just should we have enough of everything? Love you to cook it. Mm -hmm. It's perfect. That's not what we wanted. Okay, I'm gonna need more grains. Shop. Hi. Sorted grains. Wait. 
not have? I need more potatoes. Shop. Bye. Do 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 Let's see. You cook. We'll have all Initiate cooking cook, mode. But. Better than I expected. Yes. Prepared. Okay, cool. I mean we just needed one, but I was worried that we would have that it would do that would that would make the wrong things. So this will do. Let's see if this pleases the loser. Um, oh, we could serve him whatever. Um, here. Take your stupid pie. Is that? You made it using a recipe we learned at the White Birch Inn. I guess it looks alright, but the proof's in the pudding. What do you do if it doesn't agree with my distinguished palate, huh? How about you shut your pie hole and just try the damn thing? But here goes nothing. Stan took a bite of the fish pie. Huh. I knew your cooking would be as foul as that face you're making. Wait, this taste. Stan took another bite of the fish pie. Oh my word. I thought for sure this would be a disaster, but. Stan gobbled down the fish pie. Chomp chomp. <laughs> He's quiet now. Yes, it appears he likes it. Stan devoured the fish pie in no time. It's all gone? Chill out, don't eat the plates. <laughs> you kids are amazing. <laughs> Can't believe you made a dish that tasted like this. There's some subtle differences. It's very close to what Mom used to make. More importantly, it makes me happy. Uh, it's actually thanks to this recipe from the White Birch Inn. What do you mean, Mom? Are you just homesick the whole time? What? Excuse me, sir. I am a proud soldier. Don't get homesick. That's ridiculous. It's okay to be human, dude. Uh, you don't need to act like that in front of us. But... So that's why... You understand that being drafted cannot be an easy experience. Yes, we are aware that you cannot, we cannot understand everything you are currently going through, but it is difficult to be away from your loved ones, especially if your loved ones are dead. Ugh. After all, we feel the same. You do? I suppose it's not unusual to feel like this nowadays, but it's not just me having a hard time. No, in some ways, you're pretty lucky. I mean, only do my mom's cooking suck, but I can't even taste it again. Ash. You also have a good friend who's worried about you. That's right, Chris. I ignored his warning. I've got my mom and my friends. I got desperate because of the draft. I started acting out as if to hide my true emotions. I did whatever I pleased made some terrible mistakes. Ma'am, I'm sorry. Shouldn't have acted the way I did. I was selfish. I'm glad you've realized that. I feel like all of you have opened my eyes. I'll face up to what I'm feeling as I look for as I look toward the future. I have to do it for my mom and my friends back home who are worrying about me. Heh, <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. He's rid of whatever was controlling him. It seems that the influence of the curse has subsided a little. Hey, progress! With that, the group left Deccans with Stan and head to the plaza where Chris was waiting. Wow, that was incredible. You talked the sense back into Stan. And I even got an apology, too. I owe you a big thank you. Letting me off the hook way too, way too easy, don't you think? You sure you don't want to punch me? I'd let you get one in. Come on, what good is that gonna do? If you want to make up for this, you need to go around and apologize to everyone you upset here. Thank you for standing by me, man. Ah, you two really are close friends, aren't you? Better stick close together, yeah? You can 
count on it. Thank you again. I wouldn't have been able to do it without you. Ah, besties. I'd ship it. <laughs> Ooh, sparkly. What do? Or mint. Quartz. You. Ooh. That's potentially interesting. I think. Of course. I think this one would be more useful. <laughs> At least on her. Okay. So is that everything in Raquel? I think that's everything in Raquel. Let's get the heck out of here. Poor birds. Towards whatever is awaiting us in the next town. Can't be much worse than getting sold out. But yeah, it is what it is. Let's go. Here I go! My turn. Very well. I like rocking around his card because I like his special attack as far as like being able to stun enemies goes. It's finally time, Ash. We're counting on you to show us the way. Sure, sure. We just gotta follow the road till we reach the fork. Luna, keep an eye on the pendulum for any reaction. Got it. Victory is assured. You say so, pal. Let's wipe them out. Let's see. Nope. This one. Ah. This little dude. Activate Fragorok. Destroy. It's my turn. You can't escape. Pew, 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 pew. Let's get him! It's mine! Sure. What are we dealing with here? Oh, yeah. That'll do. Let's go! Mm. Can't hit him. No. Uh... It'll do. Go. Behold the Vander style. It's something. Let's go. Hmm. Have to remember that next time we're shopping. Huh. Boop. Huh. Huh. Say ya. I'll show no mercy. Very well. You. Huh. There. They're mine. I lend it. Okay, that's one down. Now. Let's see. Mm. I suppose it doesn't really matter. Charging. My turn. I can hit both. Well, we can, we might as hey, well. You! Rest in peace! It's down! I'll assist! <laughs> Not today! That'll do. That's yeah, probably fine.
Let's go. Arcus, activate. All right. Cha -cha! I shall go. Charging. <laughs> yeah. That'll do. Behold, the Vander style. I'm right. I'm going for it. It's big, ugly. It looks I'm pretty it. tough. Let's watch out. Watch out. This is a tough one. I'm not scared of it. It should be scared of me. Let's go. Evan Press. Behold, the dual blades of Vander. Now, huh. I'll end it. Ragnar, strike! That'll do. I got this. Okay. Um... What are we dealing with? Okay. Ah, we didn't. Oh, we didn't hit one. <laughs> oh well. It's my turn. Just go for it. Because there's no reason not to. My turn. Charging! Let's do this! Dragon 2! Because if you can summon the mech, why shouldn't you? It's for the tougher fight, so, like, let's go for it. Now we just have to worry about the My big turn. one. That's like a non-issue. So... Now, yeah, that's eat fine. this. Here's dessert. That's what you get for being careless. My turn. Arcus, activate. It's my turn. Sleep. My oh, that's rude. Charging. Fight me seriously. Let's go. Uh... Here I go. Oh, it just healed. That's not okay. Ha, ha! Let's get him. It's mine. Sure. Yeah, it's almost broken. So it's just nah. -uh. Very well. Arcus, activate. I shall go. Charging. Yeah. Come on. Here we go. Yeah. Give us plenty of time to actually kill it. Here I go! Alright, so no. Press back to my brave smash. Take this one. Uh, smash! Let's get him! It's mine! Anyway. My turn! It's down! They're mine! 
Now. Activate Ragorok. Destroy. It'll do. There. It's mine. I got this. Now. Eat this. Come on. Don't think Here's this is kill. That's what you get for being careless. But the assist might. Yeah. I'll assist. Come on. There we go. Ho ho ho! This little bunny's got some bite. Your weapon specs are impressive as well, Ash. They're so cute together. They're just they're just a bunch of weirdo siblings, and I'm just here for it, honestly. They're like the world's quirkiest family. Yeah. Shot. Yeah. We'll end this quick. Let's see. Eh, it'll do. Activate Bragarok. Destroy. Sure. Arcus, activate! Let's go! You. Huh. Here That's I go! I didn't expect that to do. Be your worst. <laughs> Thanks. That'll suffice. Eh? There we go. Didn't kill the sure. casting, but you know what? Mark is activate. <laughs> All right. Mark is activate. Let's go. Mm. Yeah, just hit him. There! They're mine! You don't frighten me. Mostly because of that. I'll you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Ha! Done already? The merits. Kindly. I won't go easy. Let's see. You can't escape. Fire! Let's go. Do it. That's not great, though. My turn. Charging! Kill you. My turn. Let's go! Evan press! Defense. My turn. Mm. You're mine! Boy. My turn. Huh. There. That'll do. They're mine. And that should kill. Battle complete. Let's continue. Powerful. We must take care. Watch out. I'm not this scared. Is the tough one. No. Yeah. You can't escape! Fire! Keep, 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 keep. 
My turn. It's there. Yeah. Uh, my this turn. Is the most, so that's what we'll do. Let's just go for it. What are they gonna do? Stop me? Now. Tangent. I'm not scared of these things. Not today. It's go time. Hector, Mark two. I don't think that killed any of them, but it should beat them. Oh, yeah. oh kill it. Killed all the little ones. I can handle that. That's fine. Yeah. That's a little bit better. My turn. <sighs> Rude. Marcus, activate. I shall go. Charging. All right. It's gonna fully heal next turn, so like there's no point in her attacking. Well, there's no point in her like trying very hard. Okay. It's a little weak to. Mm, I think it's better if she just attacks. My turn. Yeah. Okay. Um, huh. Just gonna go for it. <laughs> do it. I don't yeah. do. Come on. Huh. Very well. Uh, We've got this, probably. Nope. I shall go. Marcus, activate! Come on. Ha! Come on. Here I go! Just gotta chip away at it. Good. <laughs> Let's go! Let's do. Yeah. Let's go. I got this. That's gonna hurt. My turn. Charging. My turn. Yeah. It's down. That'll do. Let's go. I'll assist. Kill it. Probably won't, but I can hope. Dang it. <laughs> Let's go. Uh... It's my turn. Uh... Take this. Okay, now we should definitely <laughs> be able to do kill. it. Yeah. Targets eliminated. Move out. <laughs> Yay, I did it. Meh. Elliot levels are not that big a deal. Oh, I found some treasure! Tira. Meh. Yeah. Victory is assured. I mean, it's fine, but... I think we want to go... Hey, isn't that... Yes. Huh. That's where we fought the cryptid during our field exercises. And just beyond that is where the Ion transported the cannons. Class 8 helped to get it all under control, didn't they? That way's blocked off. We should keep moving, everyone. Yeah, I can see that it's blocked off, but let me reminisce for a minute. <laughs> Onwards. Let's see. Oh, good. We're almost there. You've made something that resembles progress. They're in disarray. Okay. 
What is your deal? Okay. Activate Fragorok. Destroy. Let's go. Use your meh overall. You. Huh. There. Get They're it. mine. Sure. He's huh. killed. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. I'll assist. Here I go. Arc is activated. Not super scared of you. That'll do. It's my turn. Cha -cha! Wide open. It's mine. mine. Here we go. Those sword tricks of yours sure came in handy. Thanks, Yuna. I trust your skills in battle. Uh, friendship. Let's go. Sha! Slash. There we go. Forwards. Yeah. I won't go easy. You can't do, 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 do. Fire! My turn. Oops, tempest edge, right here. Ah, yeah. There. They're mine. Rude. Sure. Let's go. Evan press. I got this. Do you now? You... Okay, I don't think there's any way he can start me. He can add all of them. Unfortunate. It's like they're in like just the wrong configuration for it. You're so mine. Hit these two. Yeah. I'll assist. Do. That's fine. Now. Activate Fragorok. Destroy. Should kill the far one, right? All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. to do. Uh, smash! Mm. Nice, we did it. Awesome. I must Ooh, train level. even more. I'll take that. Here's fire rates. Victory is assured. Let's see. Uri, Alster, Raquel. There's a fork in the road. Your eyes to the left. The right's mostly just mines and borderlands. Uri, that's where Stark's from, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't seem like he's working with Maya and Gustav, though, so... Your eyes... Right up ahead, huh? Ugh. Crow. The original traitor! Pendulum's pointing this way. Mine's in Borderlands, correct? Great, hey, what's up with you? Sorry, it's nothing. Come on, let's get going. I know, buddy. I know. Crow is on the list of people who we need to bonk upside the head. He's he's on the list as soon as we find him. Ha! Huh? Although opening. if he wants redemption, he redemption, he can start by, you know, saving Reen, or at least helping us save him. That would go a long way. But I get the feeling he's not going to. Or if he does, it's gonna be in like some super roundabout way. Very well. Let's see. 
get him. Uh, yeah. Sure. Do. Mm. Hey, you. This. Rest in peace. That'll yeah. do. I'll assist. Oh, I forgot she was doing that. <laughs> it's my turn. All right. Ha, ha! My turn. That'll do. If she attacks, could she kill? Yeah. yeah. Now. It's mine. Oh, this yeah, I did it. Okay. More levels. Always huh. win. Shot video. Bucks. Treasure located. Uh, I'm pretty sure I know what that does, but I want to double check. Quartz. Don't use this. I should probably switch it with something else. Maybe. Um, what did I just get? This one. Grants Earth protection resistance. Nah. I'm going to put break one in here, but I'm going to improve it to break two first chance I get. Whatever that is. Maybe right here. Yeah. Not quite. Ugh, this path's real rough. Ugh, my feet are killing me. It leads to the largest mining town in western Arabonia. Aragon Iron Mine. Oh yeah, that's where Gustav's from. In here. <laughs> Wide open. If you say so. Mm. Okay. I can work with this. Arcus, activate. Mm, I've got a couple of choices here, I think. We're just you can't gonna go escape. for it. Fire! This is good stats. Now. Mm. Charging! Hit the big one. I got this. We're going to. Let's go! Evan press! This. I got this. If you say so, buddy. We're just gonna go for it. Let's go. It's go time! Hector, Mark II! Yeah! Oh, that didn't quite kill. Ha! Dang it. I should be able to finish it pretty quickly. Let's go! Whatever. We've got this. Don't give up! Thank you. Now. Arcus, activate. Mm. Ah! Rude. It's my turn! I got this. We could kill the big one. Yeah. So let's do that. We should let's just go. need to finish you off. Yeah. I shall go. 
Yeah. There. It's mine. Here we go. That wasn't too bad. Stats updated. <laughs> nice. Awesome. On words. One of these directions. Ah, an opening. Let's see. Arcus, activate. Yeah. Arcus, yeah. activate. Right here. Hey, you! Rest in peace! I shall go. Um, with... oh, my Charging! Oh well. I goofed, but it's fine. My turn. Let's see. Arcus, yeah. activate. All right. You can't escape. Yes, Fire! Now. Charging. Let's just go for it. Gah! Gah! That'll do. Very well. Mm, could just kill you and be done with it. Yeah. It's our next turn. Yeah. Battle complete. Let's continue. Unmerits. Enemy found. Begin suppression. I'm not scared of it. Here I go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're just gonna go. I shall go. Break through! Sledgehammer! Now. Can we hit? We cannot hit everybody. We can Activate hit most of them. Ragara. Destroy. So let's go for let's it. Let's do this! Dragon 2! That'll suffice. I got this. You're mine! Do. <laughs> well, Ash might be in trouble. I'll save you. <laughs> Thanks. But that's what she's for, I suppose. I'll save you. <laughs> Thanks. Very well. Okay. First thing first, I want to do go. this. Evan Press. Let's go. And then right here. Right here. Ah, yeah. It'll do. I got this. Hey, you! It's just ruin everybody's day. First in peace! Oh, All boy. right! Mm. You can't escape! You Fire! Can't, you can't. Wide open! It's mine! Hope that killed some of them, but no. Now! Rionac activate. Fire. There. It's oh. mine. Very well. Shut. Okay. Oh, nope. It's my turn. Mm. Ta -ta! 
gonna hit it. So. I got this. Hm. My turn. Charging. Let's do. <laughs> My turn. Shot. Ha. Huh. It'll do. <laughs> Not today. All right. Ha. Ha. Ooh. My turn. There. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh well. My turn. We still kill it this turn anyway. Ha! Done already? Ooh. Current needle reached link level four. Tier two, vengeance. I know what one of those does. I have a guess about the other one, but we'll see. What was that noise? Everybody hide quick! An Imperial military truck. What's it doing way up here in the mountains? Did you see that ash? Yeah, looked like it was mostly miners. That means what I think it does, then... Somebody else is coming! Friend? I think that's friend. Class 8 combat tactics boost off. Whew. Made it through without getting spotted. Still, there's got to be something I can do about all this. Huh? Is it you, Gustav? Friend! I thought as much. Been a while, Class man. Class 7? And Ash is with you? Well, most of class seven. <sighs> wow. Never thought I'd run into you guys way out here. It's good to see you, Ash. I'm glad you're back with us. So we're pad the past, alright? Focus on the future. Yeah, thanks for that, Father Gustav. Give me some credit. I knew you'd get through all this somehow, so, you know, whatever. Heh, <laughs> thanks, I guess. All right, all right. You're very manly and unemotional. We get it. Gustav, did you come to check on your hometown? A military truck just passed by with quite a lot of miners. Yeah, everything from Argon and... <sighs> These names will be the death of me. Saxons head out. They got a large-scale job. Militaries, military got involved and they're calling for more and more workers. Probably mining for materials to use in weapons and stuff. The tanks, pins, are sold out some railway cannons. They're going to need all the iron they can get. The Empire is really going to extreme lengths for the war effort. Definitely. Everyone said I talked to said they're all getting worked to the bone all day, all night. I wish there was something I could do about it. Finally, finally the other branch campus students take the priority. Same for the goes for the instructors, right? Good luck, Gustav. You got your own stuff to deal with. Or we got our own stuff to deal with. So just what can you do with that? So just do what you can without us, got it? Yeah, I was planning to meet up with Maya and the others after I investigate your eye anyway. You ask me though, you're wasting your time looking for that singularity thing around the mines. So many people around you think someone would have noticed if there was anything that weird going on. I suppose that does make sense. If the mines are out of the question, perhaps we should concentrate on the borderlands. There's a lodge for travelers at the crossroads up ahead. It's a long way to Alster. You should probably take a break there while you still have the chance. Thanks, Gustav. You take care of yourself, okay? Yeah, let us know if you need help or anything. Friend! Okay, so where are we going? Probably this way? I don't know. If I go all the directions, one of them is bound to be correct. Yeah, this way. Yeah. Let's get him. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say probably. Yeah, that's about what I expected to find. Okay. Is that a rock? A link stone.
I'm getting the feeling that it's gonna explode. Focus activate. <laughs> if, if my time playing other JRPGs is any indication, that thing is gonna explode on me. Arcus Which activate. is not cool. Sure. So what's your deal? An opening. Oh, and it's, or it's gonna do that. Yeah. yeah. It's either super crazy high defense or prone to explosion. There's no one between with those things. Very well. And if the game wants to be really annoying, it'll do both. <laughs> oh well. We've got this. Marcus, activate. <laughs> do it. Yeah. Hop. Ha! And please kill. Not quite. But that's Here fine. I go. Um, what's your deal? Besides the obvious. Ha! You. Ha! I shall go. My turn. Charging! Boop. Ha! And die. Sure. Ha! It's down! That'll do. I'll assist. No. Nope. <laughs> Let's go. Ha! And is that gonna there. finish it? Probably. They're mine! Those sword tricks of yours sure came in handy. Huh. 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 Okay. Where are we going? Box. Into you material times five. Meh. It's right in the way. Say Time to die. Wipe them out. Arcus, activate. Yeah. Think. That might make the most sense. What's your wind resistance? You don't really have much. You're a little weak <laughs> to wind. So, ha! it'll do. This My turn. Damage. Um, order. Let's go! Evan Press! Let's go! Um, Arcus, yeah. activate! I got this. You say so, buddy. No. No. This'll do. Hey, you! I don't think it's gonna First do anything with rocks, but I get the big guy. Or that. Got no time to waste. That works. No, not the outcome I was expecting, but I'll take it. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Gimme. Chrono break car. Meh. Yeah. Break. Vic. Yeah. Unmarried. We finally made it. I can see the rest lodge from here. The journey here was far too tiring. Borderlands Northeast from here. Guess, guess we could always take a break first. I agree. Let's take the time to rest and recover while we can. Okay, well then, what are we waiting for? Let's head in. Puppy! Who's a good doggy? I say hi? Hey. The dog. It must belong to someone who lives nearby. Looks like a hunting dog to me. Who's a good doggy? <laughs> oh, 
Well, hello, travelers. Welcome to the Nos Rest Lodge. Hey there, do you have any rooms available for five? Of course, of course. Anything for some tired guests. Why don't you go ahead and take a load off in the lobby while I get your rooms ready? Phew, I'm beat. I was aware of the difficulties of climbing mountain roads, but the fatigue has piled up faster than I had anticipated. Bring to the middle of the front desk. This is the halfway point of the trail. We should only be about an hour from, Al from Ulster. There's also a junction that leads to the North Ambrian border along the way. Oh yeah, that's where Valstein came from, right? That's right. You should let her know if you learn anything about what's going on there. Speaking of North Ambria, or the North Ambria province, rather, now that it's become part of the Empire, it should be facing the effects of the Great Twilight as well. It won't be out of the question for a singularity to be there, then. Still, we should probably focus on the mare for now. Agreed. We have to search for Sandy and Elster, after all. We'll be cutting it close, but it still falls within the bounds of the mare. Come to think of it, isn't Elster Prince Oliver's hometown? Oh, really? Rip. That's right. He lived there until he was twelve. Not so. I remember my brother going there as part of his highness's guard. The news of his fate must have been quite shocking for the locals. It'd be hard not to hear about it, even way out here in the sticks. Yeah. Sandy always seems so proud to know him, too. My, who have we here? Oh, boy. Hi, friend? Question mark? Wow, she's gorgeous. Uh, hi? Can we help you? <laughs> Do forgive me for butting in. I simply couldn't help myself. You are students, are you not? You've chosen a curious time to go hiking, what with the war on. We're on our way to meet a friend who lives in the area. I don't mean to be rude, but who exactly are you? You don't look like you're from around oh, here. Oh, me? I just drove down here from north of the Empire. I had a work assignment to take care of, you see, and... A moment, if you would. Miss Lucy, please. You can't just go around talking to random locals like that. Yes, yes, I know. But something about these young people simply piques my interest. Uh, is everything okay over there? So you came from North Ambria, huh? Judging by the fancy Roblocker out front. I doubt you're actually from there. I guess I'd say you're actually from Inferia. Huh. Oh my, well aren't you perceptive? It's true that I'm that I'm here in Erebonia for work, though. I had business to attend to in Hollisk, so I figured this would be the best route to take. Hollisk, as in North Ambria's old capital city. That sounds like a long journey, even by car. My turn, then. You said you had friends nearby, right, in Ulster? How exactly did you get to know someone who lives all the way out here? Huh? Well, well why do you want to know? Oh, no reason in particular. You just don't look like your old, your run-of-the-mill travelers, is all. Who'd hike up a monster-infested trail when you could travel by train or car instead? It's almost as if you're trying to pass through without attracting attention. We're only cutting to the chase, huh? If you noticed all that, I doubt you're normal travelers either. Oh, but we're as normal as normal can be. You can check your passports if you like. You have a fairy at passports, I might add. I assure you, our entry into Erebonia was completely legal and totally above board. Huh. Where's she going with this? I, don't, I can't read her at all. I'm a fairy and passports and legal entry into the country. Feels like you're stressing those points in particular. Yeah. Oh, I get it now. Bombshell babe on the right here, your typical your typical word of the mill Remifarian for sure. She even got plant the blood hair, just like Louise. But you on the other hand My apologies, it's it would seem we've been had. Not not yet we haven't. I'd recommend you abandon this line of questioning. We all have our secrets. 
I'd hate to shut you up here and now. Hmm. What? Dear me, things certainly are getting lively over here. Oh no, who's this now? But fighting simply won't do. This is a place of rest and relaxation. Who are you? Ah, huh? Could it be? Oh, I think we know her. Our apologies, Miss Manager. I do hope we didn't disturb anyone. We're just leaving, but I'd love to stop by again sometime. Food here was just delightful, those vegetable dishes especially. Please do. I'll keep a spot at the dinner table open for you. Well, feel free to take an extra helping or two for the road. You're too kind. Thank you so much. I guess this is where we part. I hope you manage to meet up with your friend, okay? Hmm. Sorry for the trouble. There they go. That uh, one lady was really fierce, huh? Fierce doesn't begin to cover it. Chick was ready to take us up and t was up and take us out. Her friend didn't seem like the valid type at all, however. Wow, you guys are pretty sharp, huh? On that note, it's good to see you again, Adele. And you as well, Elliot. It's been far too long. Oh, then that means... Are you a Thor's graduate, too? Adele. That's right. My name is Adel, and I'm currently the proprietor of this lodge. Adel. Whoops. <laughs> Look, we're, we're just gonna do our best with these names. Though Class 7 may know me better as the head of the gardening club. I was a year ahead of them. Ah. Uh, I see. This land must belong to your family, then. Yes, my father is only a minor Viscount, but we do quite well for ourselves, considering. Bringing here is a wonderful way to support my studies and hobbies both. You don't say. But you make good business out of a, but you get some good business out of a middle of nowhere place like this. There must be plenty of people passing through their way to Ulster in the mines. Yes, even more so of late. Though most of them are miners to soldiers, I don't see many people like you, like those two from earlier, very often. Interesting. Well, either way, we found it the worst graduate. This shape is shaping. This trip is shaping up to be worth it already. I'm guessing you must be in touch with the others, right? That's right, I'm up to speed with Vincent, as well as the other alumni further east. Nothing from Phoebe or Ferris quite yet, though. That said, the Baptist and me can't help but be curious about those reddish-black plants I've been hearing about lately. It sounds like Pleroma grass, all right. Can you... do you know anything I might narrow, d narrow down where it could be? Well, it's mostly been people from Ulster talking about it. Those women from earlier asked about it as well. They must be up to something. Were they also headed to Ulster, by any chance? Yes, they were only stopping here for one night. But apart from its distillery, the town doesn't have much in the way of tourist attractions. And with residents getting drafted left and right, I don't see why anyone would want to go there now. Hmm. And here I thought this trip was going to be boring. I still need to talk to Sandy. Once you've rested up, it's time to move out. In that case, you'll need a hot meal to horrify you for the road ahead. I recommend our lodge specialty. I grow the vegetables myself on the family's estate. Wow, that sounds delicious. Thank you. We'd love to try some. You and the others eat their fill of Edel's specialty dish. After recuperating from their long journey, they then set out towards Ulster. HP, EP, and CP fully recovered. Neat. Talk. Serve it to me to pizza. Gimme. Try the recommended dish. Shop. Exchange. Uh, bye. Hmm. Okay. Away we go. So, based on this map, Ulster should be... To the left. The path meanders quite a bit, though. 
Well, it's not getting any shorter. Let's get going. Hmm, where have I been going? I think I'm gonna call this here for today. And we will pick this up next time. Till then, have a wonderful day. See all of you then. Bye bye for now. <laughs>